Hey everybody, Mariko Curry here, bringing you part 8 of Let's Play Mega Man X Command Mission. In the last part, we saved Nana from the dreaded Silverhorn. I'm trying to remember, I'm trying to make sure I don't say Steelhorn. And in this part, we are going, we also arrived in Dark Room, which is the name of this area, which doesn't really matter, but I just want to make sure I put that in there. Anyways. So in this part, we are going to continue on and head towards Silverhorn to take uh, to take him on, as well as probably explore some extras right after this. But first, we are going to continue on through this area towards Silverhorn. X, can you hear me? Oh God, it's the precursor to Alia. I found something out about uh, I found something out about the facility up ahead. Listen carefully. X, do you see the red and blue panels in the center of the room? If you step on the panels in the correct order, you can deactivate the locks and proceed. But the wrong order will activate an alarm, alerting the security guards. You must be careful. This is the correct order for that room. Please watch carefully. So just step on them in the right order so that they light up, right? Sounds like a piece of cake. Just follow the command. Ball, uh, balls in your cortex. Who are you, Charles Barkley? Shut up! But just to give an example of what would happen... Incorrect sequence. Security personnel engage. They don't even show up, you just you just get thrown into a battle. And it's not even against actual security guards, you're, you're just facing basic enemies again. Uh, let me just finish these guys off real quick. They don't actually, they don't take that long. Well, maybe their animations might. But yeah, so, this is, I, I kind of feel bad for, like, the last episode for it, because I was really hoping for uh, us to actually get through it quickly, so that way we can get to the boss fight and make it back to the area, and, like, pretty much try to get as much stuff as possible into one video. But I was too busy talking about my stories about why I hate doctors now, and I just kind of got caught up with it that I ended up uh, making the video longer than I needed to be. Wow, that was a great kaboom. So it was so great I didn't even get to hear it. There we go. That's a kaboom. I did it. All right. X, are you all right? I'll show you the correct order one more time. All right. There we go. And it has like a and it uses a basic. Uh, Doorbell ring, uh, ring to tell you that you got it right. All right, next area. This is the correct order for that room. Please watch carefully. All right, blue, blue, red, yellow. But there's actually something else we can do. If you can see on the map, you can see there's five crystals or items that we can pick up if we put in a different sequence. Uh, luckily, thanks to the web, the website Mega Man homepage, who gives out basically good uh, in-depth reviews of ga of every Mega Man game at least that's re that's been released in America and Japan, which is basically both the only areas they can be released in. Whatever. But uh, thanks to them, they actually gave they actually have the list of uh, combinations for each room. So for this room, instead of red uh, or blue, red, and yellow, we have yellow, red, and blue. <laughs> Ding dong. All right, and that door opens up. Um, not that one. Here we go. No, no, that's the door we came in. Here we go. And we get build shield, build speed, build power, build life energy, and build armor. So basically one of each. Alright, so now we can put in the right uh, actual combination. Keep on going. I like I like it when when video games have like very uh, secret rooms that you can actually or secret areas that you can actually access and or if you explore a little bit or I mean, I guess you could con you can kind of figure it out on your own. But I also like it when they hide secret things that you can discover like later on in uh, after the game or 
while you're playing the game. And you know, you get you get yourself a little bit of a boost uh, if it's actually something useful that you can use. Anyways. Oh god. How can I remember that? Uh, 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 red! No. Alright, in this room we got... Blue, yellow, red. And that unlocks that item right there. And I forget what red ones do. Oh, they're tank parts, right. Alright, oh, actually, let me see. Ah, we're just missing one piece. We're missing the, the legendary treasure called One Piece. Uh, let's see. And there's also another one in here. So it's red, yellow, blue. And that opens the door right in front of us. And that gets us... Ooh, nice. All right. We get... Figure... Oh, I think they're all figure tokens. Nice. Oh, no. Figure tokens and money. Alright, and the way out is yellow, blue, red. Alright. And one more room. This is the correct order for that room. Okay, yellow, red, green, and blue. But in this room, the actual combination is yellow... Ah, oh, crap, I've messed up. Um... If I, op if I open the door, will that not let me out? Uh, you know what? I'll, I'll, I'll take the mistake. Okay, so throughout that whole entire fight, all the enemies just started attacking Massimo, so he's pretty low on health right now, so I hope I don't mess this up again. Alright, this time... Okay, I did it backwards. It was blue, red, yellow. Right? Oh, but I don't get attacked? Okay, good. Alright, fine, I'll do it. I'll do it right. Hopefully. Okay, blue. Red. Yellow. the combination right here. I, it didn't say anything about a green, but I'm going to guess it's either the last one or the first one, so let's try it the first one. Green, blue, red, yellow. Oh, okay, so I guess I was right. I didn't see that. I, I only... Things the previous rooms only had blue, red, and yellow, so I guess I only read those only. Anyways, for it we got Queen of Diamonds. Seems actually good, and I need to heal these guys up. Alright, so Spider... Jack of Spades, Queen of Diamonds. Woo! Raised up his stats by a lot. Wait. Oh yeah, they did. Okay. Yeah, everything went went up. Let's definitely give him that. Uh, sub tanks. Let's give him. Um... I don't want to use all of it. I'll go 80 for now. Let me check their status. How close are they to the next to another level? Each fight is about a hundred, so X and Massimo should be getting a level up soon. So what I'll do? How much do I have left? Nah, I, I think I'll save it. All right, so which way is the way out? No, oh, well this way. All right. Deep prison area. Uh, I'll save later, mainly because I don't want to risk this footage getting corrupted or, and or, especially since there's going to be a lot of footage of me cutting out and cutting out because of uh, how long the video ended up being. All right, so let's use on you. I really want to get rid of you because you seem to do the most damage. This is nothing. That literally is nothing. 
almost juggled them right there. Alright. Uh, let's just get rid of one. I know there's, some, there's somewhat of a very small fight to be dealing with right now, but might as well just do it out of the way right now, or just get something in this in, in this video because it's mostly just been a. Uh... Ooh, what was that? Good card. Eh? What was that? Nice. Oh, and we got so many items out of that, but not not level up. Hold on, I want to see what what Queen of Diamonds do, does. Does it have like some kind of money effect? Weapon 75 or more equals final blow boosts Zenny. Oh, dude, that's awesome! That will definitely help when it comes to uh, making money uh, to help buy some new weapons. And I'm guessing that's where the final boss is. Stop right there! This way is to solitary confinement. Release of these vic uh, vicious criminals could cause havoc. The prisoners held here once ran rampant in Giga City. These evil louts caused their share of damage already. That's why we're lo they're locked up here. We're here to make sure they never roam free again. Locked engaged. Alright, so I guess we'll continue on. Hey, we can't get any further. Nana, can you do something about this door? That door can be operated remotely. Let me fix the system. I'm sorry, it'll take some time to boot up. Hey, where's Massimo? Um, about Massimo. I'm afraid that person may not be the real Massimo. He seems to be a little bit different from the one we have on record in the database. I didn't want to say anything. I understand. Well, maybe he went to check on the real Massimo in the underground cell. Yup. There was a route down near here. Let's go check it out. I'll stay here and scour the database for more information. Be careful, the both of you. <sighs> oh, my! It's... you. Oh, my! What have they done?! This is what they do when you refuse to join their clan. Glad I left the armor in your hands. No, I'm not strong like you. Only the real steel, Massimo. Only you and your strength deserve to wear this armor. I'll never be as strong as you. You. You have much strength. You just don't realize it. You can be even stronger than I was. Take the armor. Be strong. Massimo left the party. I was just enjoying that music for a little bit. Uh, I ran from battle because I did not want to like have Massimo not have enough uh, or not ex have the same experience as a uh, or just kind of fall behind uh, uh, Spider and uh, X since you know he's already behind enough. Anyways. You don't look so good. So, did you say hi to the guy that they mi that mistook you? That they mistook you for? Um, X. I actually... I'm... We must hurry. Nana's waiting. Massimo joined the party again. So he wasn't even gone for that long. They could they could have just cut out this whole entire part of just like meeting up with him. They could have just showed a cutscene of like spider and uh, X just like meeting up 
down here. Eh, but... I don't know, it doesn't really matter right now. Anyways, now that we have Massimo back in our team... Also, I wonder... Oh, no. Is that Nana? It came from the left. Something's happened ha Happened to Nana. Wait, let's go. Okay, hold on. Actually, Massimo's health went back to normal... Uh, went... Got refilled uh, during that whole entire scene. So only X uh, needs to be re recharged completely. And I hit my mic. Hopefully, hopefully the audio quality is still the same. I realized uh, earlier that I put my microphone too close to my mouth, or at least like I put the microphone like leveled uh, where my mouth should be, and that seems to cause like very loud and very distorted uh, audio. So I just leave it a little bit above my mouth, uh, my, where my mouth uh, is, so that way it doesn't cause that audio problem. Um, gain, gain hyper and 100 energy. Does that, did that fill up everything? Ah, close, but whatever. Alright, so, I think we got everything set, so let's go on and face Silverhorn. What the? Nana! So, these are the rats who were scurrying around our death camp. <laughs> Fools. How dare you resist the rebellion army? So, you're the head honcho here? What have you done to Nana? <laughs> Nana's been a bad girl. So, she's being punished. Don't you dare touch her! The weak ones have no choice. They should just obey the strong ones. Obey the rebellion forces. The slight vermin of the world. <laughs> Must bow down to our power. Hmm? Is that Massimo? No. Of course not. I took that feeble Massimo and turned him into so much crap. Feeble Massimo? Oh, certainly. As feeble as they come, he refused to join us. So I tore him limb from limb. Rip! Rip! <laughs> <laughs> Feeble Massimo? Feeble Massimo! You son of a! Okay, I will. I like to talk a little bit during this fight. Oh, okay, let me talk. Let me talk about the Ready boss fight to be first. Destroyed. Whoa! This is Silverhorn. As you can see, he ta he mainly attacks with ice slash water based attacks. And seeing as we're in an underwater base, that kind of makes sense. Though, the reason why he has a horn and or looks more like a rhinoceros slash some kind of horn dinosaur looking thing doesn't really uh, uh, kind of mix with the underwater lair kind of thing, but whatever. Uh, he is weak against thunder attacks. That's why I have X equipped with uh, the Thunder Buster and the Thunder Missile. Uh, he and also everybody has a water guard uh, equipped to them. At least I think so. I don't know about the spider though. Anyways, he will do a lot of attacks, very strong attacks as well. Your best bet is to again use X's hyper hyper mode as well as uh, somewhat of Massimo's uh, hyper mode as well, as that does, also does a lot of damage. Anyways, continuing on, I like to talk about how. The quality of the uh, voice acting kind of shifts uh, shifts a lot in this game. For example, during the scene when Massimo was talking with the real Massimo, it, his movements when he got very upset, saying that he wasn't strong enough to to, mass to the real Massimo, kind of thought that he was gonna like you know be more gritty or like uh, have more uh, emphasis on his on his voice. But he just seems to talk normally when he's like shaking his fist and like just gets uh, just it just seems like he should have been more emotional in that kind of in that uh, situation. Oh, we got shot absorber. I want to find out what that does. Ooh, tidal wave. 
Oh god, that hurts. Everybody's everybody's in the, in the yellow. All right, uh, let me let X uh, le uh, defend. No, actually, no. I'm um, attack. You can probably survive that. That doesn't really do that much damage. Uh, let's see. There we go. I'm gonna I'm gonna let Massimo try to save up his energy. Um, I really don't want them to anyone to die right now. So let's get everybody uh, 50. I'll save the. Ma uh, uh, I need to keep an eye on my uh, life energy tank so that way I can make sure to get ready to use a max when I need it. Eh, that didn't do that much. All right. X is at max, so let's do this. Charge shot. Now. Yeah. No. Nice. All right. Another another moment is that where X was also talking or saying that you get uh, uh don't touch her. That also had some good uh emotional uh kind of like tone to it. Not to mention it also got, went well with his like animation of him shaking his fist and, and such. No! And finally, I also I also like to mention I I love how they tried to censor uh, son of a uh, son of a bitch with with just like mis misspelling or not misspelling but like changing the way you you spell uh, son of a with uh, with S U V V A or S U V V N A I think. They, they spelled it, I forget. Can we get- can we really get this melt missile to actually work? Yeah, let's go to hyper mode. Here goes nothing. Even though he is a water type, I don't, I don't think- I don't think specifically that X-Fire uh, causes X to be fire-based. At least I don't think so. Um, I'll use only Shell Buster and that's it. I need X to charge up his uh, weapon energy. Mm, spider. The thing is that he has a lot of health, so he's not going down easily. Um, again, defend. Because I know he's going to do something strong like Tidal Wave again. Or Ultra Blizzard. Ooh. Alright. Oh, actually, I got it. Hold on. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There it is. Mega, uh, Mega Thunder. Nice. Alright, let's use, action. Let's use Massimo's action trigger. Button mashing! The game! There we go. Stay down! I didn't infect him because it was a fire-based attack, but that still does pretty good damage. All right, let's use Spider again. Hopefully, maybe he can get a better setup of cards. All right, two pair. Let's see if we can go for three. Ah, eh, that's still good. How's that? Ah, I thought it was gonna be frozen. All right, here we go. Nice. Wasn't enough to finish him off, but at least I did a good, or a, actually not even good, a uh, whole ton of damage. But that leave that left us pretty weak. All right. Um, what else do we have in items? Do we have anything good? Heals binding status. Restores hyper mode activation to max. Clear vision. Boost shield. Oh, during battle. Oh, that. Oh, I was thinking of build. Okay. I should have probably been started. I should have probably been using this for a while. All right, hold on. Let's see. Heal status effects. Oh, we still have me more mega thunders. Um. What else do we have? Build berserk. Heal saint. Da, da, da. Would this work? Would it? God. Try it. It probably won't, but let's give it a shot. No, I didn't think so. All right. Um, we only have enough to heal one person. Massimo's pretty close to dying, but he has not that much of 
shielding. God. How much health do you have, man? Oh, jeez. Alright. I don't have any more attacks, so might as well just use... Uh, my true power! Just gonna use this attack. And there we go. Stay down! Oh, final strike. Nice. No. Or not. God, that was close. Need more power. Nice. Oh, we got an ice buster for that. And a build hyper. Oh, look at those level ups. Alright, nice! Steel Massimo would never, ever, lose to scum like you! Scum that uses force to crack the wills of the weak! Once there was a man, he despised his own weakness. So he sought Massimo for strength. Massimo was a hero who used his strength to fight for the weak. I... I wanted to be like Massimo. As strong as Massimo! But now he's dead. What do I do now? X... I... I... I'm a fraud! Well, one thing is clear. Steel Massimo will always fight as long as the Rebellion Army stands. Right, Massimo? Steel Massimo, will you fight together with us? We don't even get an answer. We just we just assume that he says yes. Anyways, chapter cleared. So, we finally saved Nana from the Tiana camp, as well as the POWs, and... We uh, gain a new party member of Steel Massimo, the second. So, with all that done, we can now save and uh, continue on in the next part. I was hoping to have enough time to get through uh, to, to show off some cool stuff that happens back at the uh, res uh, Resistance base, but that boss fight lasted longer than I thought it would. So, we're going to have to save that for the next episode. It's not a lot, it's not much, but it's something interesting that you, uh, I say the, the background of, uh, of one of them is interesting, and the other one is just only some ex little extra that you get for playing through the game. But anyways, with all this done, we got into chapter 3, we finished through chapter 3, and we're going to head off to chapter 4 soon. So... If you like this video, subscribe to my videos, white little button, give me a good thumbs up review down below this video, and check out my other parts if you like this one. In the next part, we are going to continue on with Chapter 4, as well as find more secrets about this game, and head off to our new destination. And who knows, we might see a returning uh, character in the, in, in the next chapter. And I just spent five seconds just to figure out that we won't that we won't be. So don't take my word for it. Anyways, uh, I will see you guys in the next episode.